election. He will be missed by us all, but his legacy on and off the field will never be forgotten. May he rest in peace. Materia today. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Uh, on behalf of the Greens, I stand to support the motion. Sir Wilson Winneray donned the All Black jersey 77 times and led the All Blacks when the pay rate was about a dollar a day for a sportsman. <laughs> but that wasn't an issue for him. Sport was more about more than money in those times. He was a man who loved his family, his country and his rugby. He did not seem to be a man who caused a controversy, but he did find himself in one when he captained the 1960 All Blacks tour of South Africa. That tour raised the issues of racism here in New Zealand and led to an increasing awareness of racism both here in Aotearoa and overseas. Aotearoa has moved on from those times and indeed Sir Wilson expressed different views over the 1981 tour. As well as Sir Wilson's great feats as an All Black, I think it's worth remembering the good work he did as the chair of the Hillary Commission in the 1990s. He came from an era where people wanted to play sport for the love of it, and his work at the Hillary Commission, he said about making certain that young New Zealanders got involved in sport. He realised that for a sports-mad country like Aotearoa to continue to achieve success at the elite level, it was important for all New Zealanders to be involved in sport. Fair play, coaching, administrative support for sports bodies at all levels and programmes for all ages were areas that were greatly developed under Sir Wilson's time. To Sir Wilson, one of the most satisfying aspects of his time at the Hillary Commission was the continuing developments in children's sports. It is the most rewarding and stimulating part of what we do, he said. Sir Wilson should be remembered, therefore, not only as a great All Black, but as a man who gave back to the community and encouraged all New Zealanders to get out there and to participate. On behalf of the Green Party, we send our sincere condolences to his family, to his friends. Thank you. Brendan Horan. New Zealand First.